What's up guys, Sleepy Jirachi here, and today we are going to Pokegen in Pokemon Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire with only your 3DS, an SD card, and your game card. Revolutionary stuff by Sires M, the man of the hour. Um, absolutely fantastic. This is very easy, very simple, and I am going to walk you through this. I will cover a few questions and things at the end, including how to use PK Hex properly, if you have any questions, so stick around to the end if you really need to know, but right now we're going to jump right into it. Take your SD card out of your 3DS and put it into your computer, and you will now have this beautiful beautiful thing that shouldn't have these files download the mega that i have in the description the first download in the description will be these two files a code.bin and a pokemon.ekx now the pokemon.ekx is the standard one that sires himself actually included in the game uh, or included for his demonstration so this is a hoopa named hoops with his ot and then code.bin is what actually runs this code so you want to uh, put both of these on the root of your SD card, the very bottom of your SD card. And once you do that, download it, put it on the root of your SD card, take the SD card out. That's all you had to do. Very, very simple stuff. Very simple stuff. And now you're going to put it back in your 3DS because you're totally awesome. And once it is back in your 3DS, you're going to launch Pokemon Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. One or the other. Can't be both. And this is where it gets even easier than it already was. Now you load the game. Go ahead and load your game. You think you're real cool loading your game around, you know, whatever. Um, now check your box. Nothing in box one slot one, right? You got emptiness in here? Coolio. Coolio, totally cool. Uh, that's what you want. So make sure you have nothing in box one slot one, which if you didn't just see is This this what I'm pointing to with the little red dude this right here Nothing in there. It's gonna be overwritten if you have anything So if you want to get rid of something put it there and it'll get rid of it By replacing it with a new Pokemon of course now once you do that close out of your box uh, face away from your PC. None of these rules are needed, but that's what I do. And now go without closing the game. Do not close the game. Leave the game open. Go to your internet browser. This is where stuff gets really intense, okay? We're going to go into our internet browser and go to URL. And once you click on URL, it should load the URL Majiggy. Enter. Enter Majiggy. Uh, might take a while because my browser is a nerd. Here we go. Now we have nothing here, right? Load code. Okay, load code. L O A D C O D E dot project Pokemon dot org. So if you want to take a look at that, uh, load code. Dot project Pokemon dot org. It's that simple. Enter that in there. Let it load the code. It's going to say failed to load part of this page. That's okay. That is perfectly fine and acceptable. That's actually what you want. An error will occur. It says, please save your software currently in use and then restart the system. Don't do that. Don't listen to it. That just means it worked. Now you go back into your game. Go ahead back and check your box. And you should have Hoopa right here. And if you don't, don't panic. Just as I see, do you see that I'm not panicking? I don't have Hoopa in my first box. And there is a reason for this. This might happen. And I probably should have covered this beforehand. But if you go into your browser... Go to this little anchor wrench anchor. Go to this wrench and go to clear history and delete cookies. Most of you will probably have to do this if you have used your internet before. Now you should have no internet now. Go to menu, 
Go back to URL. Wait for it to load. Music is by Pokey Remix Studio. Fantastic remixer. He will be in the description. All right. Do it again. Load code. Dot project Pokemon. You can save this into your bookmarks if that makes it easier. Dot org. Enter it in there. Let it load the code. Should do the same thing it did last time. Except this time. It worked. There we go. Hoops by Sire M. That is his Hoopa. Uh, it has all these hack moves. You can essentially make crazy, crazy hack mons with this stuff, man. You have unlimited potential right now. You go into PKX and you can do anything. And I will elaborate on that. Um, this will only work a few things, a few things. This will only work in Cisnan, not Emu Nan. If you don't know what those things are, you are on Cisnan, and it doesn't matter. Don't worry about it. Uh, a few other things. Sometimes you might get a bad egg. If you do get a bad egg, this is not a terrible thing. That just means that you didn't properly make the Pokemon.ekx file. Um, it might be a PKX, or it might be some random you don't know what you're doing, and I will cover that in a moment as well. Um... Now, now, now. Basically, that's, I mean, that's it. That, that you should be now done. If you got it working, great for you. If you need to know how to use PK Hex, sit around. Um, if it doesn't work, obviously, as you saw, clear your browser history and cookies. And that should work. This only works on the firmware 9.0 to 9.4. Now, some people have been like, oh, it probably will get patched. It's probably not going to get patched. Honestly, they're just going to push the old 3DS. Oh, it doesn't work on new 3DS. They're going to push the old 3DS out of here, and they're going to bring in the new 3DS. And this will not work on the new 3DS. only works on the old 3DS and 3DS XL. So keep your old 3DS around, because it's going to have a lot of use. Trust me. This, this, what, when they discovered this browser exploit, and now Spider Tools, they're going to go crazy on this stuff, and we're going to have power. We're going to have some crazy power here. Um, so this is essentially Pokegen 6th Gen. We have it. We now have it easily for the common user. And this is fantastic, fantastic, fantastic stuff. Um, if you have any other questions, leave them in the, uh, the comments below. I will try to answer them. If you are worried that you didn't get a Pokedex entry for the Pokemon you injected, that's because you essentially skipped the part where you actually acquire it. So if you really want the Pokedex entry, put it into Pokebank and take it back. Trade it with your friend and take it back. If it's a legal Pokemon, trade it with a local game, doesn't matter. Um, but this is essentially really cool. You can now leave if you got everything you need. If you need to know how to use PKX, I will now cover that. So uh, stick around for that stuff. It's about to get crazy in here. Now, when you use PKX, and we will switch over to my desktop. That's not it. My beautiful desktop. When you use PK Hex, um, you'll probably Ooh. download it. There will be a download to that in the description as well. Uh, you can. What you can do is you can actually change it to say PK. Now, okay, I will show you the folder right here. How I edit this. This is in my Cyber Gadget folder, just because. Um, PK hacks. If you change it to PK hacks instead of hex, that will allow you to basically make illegal Pokemon really easily, like any ability and stuff like that. Very cool. That's what I do to make my hack bonds. Um. Anyway, here's how this works. Now, this is PK hacks right here. You want to make a Pokemon? It would be fantastic if you actually started with a base Pokemon. So, what I would actually recommend is starting with a Pokemon like, for example, uh, the one I gave you, the one that came in the download, the one that came with the download below, 
that would be a really good place to start. So we're probably going to use that one. Uh, it's called Hoops. It's a lot easier to use this kind of Pokemon just because... I'm going to have to extract it. It's a lot easier to use this kind of Pokemon because... For reasons. No, because it's already set up. And that's essentially why it's easier to use this. Sorry, I'm just stalling while I... Well, I open this file. Okay, here we go. We got hoops. I personally like to have the box interface open, despite the fact that I'm not actually editing a save. Okay, so this is your species editor. This is your shiny button. If you make it shiny, you can't unshiny. You have to re-roll, okay? Uh, if you want something shiny, you have access to every single Pokemon under the sun. This includes Volcanion, Hoopa, anything you want. Uh, for this example, we will use Volcanion. We're going to name it Hot Stuff. I just came up with that now. I'm really smart. Um, we're going to make it Adamant. No. Let's make it Modest. Uh, held Item. This gives you access to a lot, a lot of Held Items. Um, including stuff that isn't really meant to be held. Squirt Bottle, stuff like that. This has every single item that the game has, including stuff that's not what you want um she's got a lot of stuff here uh but you can basically put any of this on there if you want if you want to have a travel trunk and oros you can try that some of this stuff will uh crash the game but basically you can put whatever you want we're gonna put a zap plate just because we're weird um give it any ability you want parental bond obviously Hello? Okay, make it shiny, ugly yellow, my favorite. Uh, I wouldn't mess with this stuff, but you can if you want to. Now, if you're going to make a legal Pokemon, you're definitely going to need to not use this one. Just use an actual, like, Pokemon from somewhere. Uh, you can download PKX files from around the web. Uh, if you want to, you can hit me up on Twitter. Maybe I'll upload, like, a public PKX file that's just a random Pokemon that, like, could be legal. But basically... You can set it to anywhere you want. And it also depends on what game you want. So say it's from Pearl. This Volcanion is all the way from Pearl. And we caught it at Reversal Mountain. That's not even Pearl. That's friggin' 5th gen. Isn't it? Yeah, whatever. But, uh... Desert Resort from Pearl. That's where we got it. Met at level 100. It is level 100. This is the level. This is the experience. Okay. Uh, all this stuff. You could say you met it as an egg. Not important. Uh, these are this. Hack stats will not be able to use even in local battles or the Mason, but you will be able to use it against, like, in-game trainers. So that's fun, I guess. But uh, basically all that stuff. You can randomize your IVs, randomize your EVs. Tons of fun there. Um, contest stats are actually really good for Oros. You can set them all to max. There should be a max button, but no. Um, Sheen is not important. Sheen is actually a third-gen thing, but... Go into your attacks, you got all these cool attacks, uh, hyperspace hole, you could give it hyperspace fury, but it won't learn it. Um, you could just give it whatever, thousand arrows is fine. Um, this is the PP editor, this PP you can edit, but it's not really gonna change for a while until you heal up or something. Uh, steam eruption, you have access to all the moves here, relearn moves are moves that you can relearn. And, uh, here's the OT, we can easily change that to sleepy. But make the latest sires, uh, stuff like that. That's basically that. I'm gonna re-roll it so it's not shiny. And then you hit save as. Okay. And when you're saving as, you're going to want to save it somewhere like, let's see, your SD card maybe? And we can re-inject this Volcanion into the game just to prove that we're super awesome and this works. Now. I'm going to put my SD card in. Okay, you should have made that whole shebang. Let's go ahead and go to save as. See, this is the root of my SD card. We're going to want to save it as an EKX file, and you're definitely going to want to have it named Pokemon.EKX. Uh, so I'm just going to overwrite what already exists. Now, we should have that Volcanion on our SD card. If we go ahead and take the SD card out, put it back into our 3DS... Let's switch on over to our 3DS scene here. Uh, load the game. Mm -hmm. 
blah 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 all right the game should now be loaded do, 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 do. really cool sound effects um yeah the game is now loaded go ahead and open your box I don't have Hoopa in there anymore because I didn't save when I took the stuff out but it's not a big deal um so basically do that go ahead and go like this if you do have problems I tend to have problems most of the time I go into this um, you can just hit the wrench every time just to be certain clear history real quick clear cookies real quick it, it takes a quick two seconds uh, go back to the menu go back to URL um, wait for it to load because it takes a while Or at least mine takes a while. I don't know why. I don't know if your guys' takes a while, but mine does. It might just be because I hacked my 3DS. So we're loading this URL stuff. There we go. Go ahead to load code. Dot project Pokemon. Dot org. Failed to load part of this page, as per usual. Error occurred. Very nice. Love those errors, you know. Love erroring my 3DS. And now we go into Organize Boxes, and there it is. Sleepy Hot Stuff, the Volcanion. Has all those moves. Parental Bond, Zap Plate, Modest. It's... It's... This is... This is huge, guys. This is big. I hope that helped. If you do have any more questions, Go ahead and leave a comment below. I will make sure, I will try to make sure that I get to all of them. Uh, but if I already answered one, I'm probably not going to answer yours. Just look around in the comments if you really have questions. Control F for your questions. Stuff like that. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to leave a like if this was helpful. Really would appreciate that. Um, subscription would also be nice, you know. I try to help out. I do a lot of hacking stuff, stuff like this. And I hope that helped. Um, all the credits and stuff can be found in the description. Shout out to all of my fans, 25k, and also, of course, shout out to Teeny V, because he helped me in life. And, of course, to Sires M, because he's awesome and he is fantastic, and he is the messiah of hacking for 6th gen. This is incredible stuff. Um, very incredible stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys next time. Enjoy your hack mons or your legal mons. Just enjoy Pokey Jenning in general, and I will see you guys later.